All right, YouTube, so we are back, of course, talking about some Final Fantasy VII Remake. And today we just have a couple of quick bits of info. Going forward this week, it looks like we're going to be getting some more info for Remake and Intergrade um, from possibly two locations. One of them is there's an orchestra concert coming up on, like, the 17th and 18th. We don't really need to, like, hype it up too much. We did this with the last concert in February. We're super hyped about it. They even had the devs there to talk about the game and also the bullshit. And there wasn't anything new there, and it was kind of underwhelming for what we were looking for anyways. And of course, it wasn't that the concert itself was bad, but we we're expecting info for the game, and it ended up not happening. So we're not putting too much stock into this upcoming orchestra concert, but there could be stuff there. There's always that possibility. The other thing is the remake, or more specifically, Integrate, is guaranteed to be in this new weekly Famitsu that is happening on Tuesday, so that should be tomorrow. Now, as for what the info is going to be, it's kind of hard to speculate. DKHF thinks, you know, new renders, screenshots, or info, or whatever, and it specifically mentions Vice for some reason. Um, I don't necessarily think they're going to give us a character render for Vice, since he's meant to just be, like, a optional boss that's in, like, the battle simulator. Like, that'd be the equivalent of if they dropped, like, a character render before Remake came out of Pride and Joy. Like, that just doesn't make any sense. Like, why would they do that? Unless he's integral to the story, there's no reason to give us a character render of him. Maybe that's not an exact one-to-one -one comparison since we're actually seeing him within the trailer for Integrate and we're seeing Deep Ground, so he could be a little more integral to the game than just some random boss within the battle simulator, but that's what we've heard so far. Some of the stuff is I've seen people kind of speculate on, of course, the other ports for Remake whenever those may or may not happen. I don't think that's going to be the case here since specifically they say that Integrate's going to be in the Famitsu article, not just Remake as a whole. Also, don't think that they would just announce the game coming to other platforms in just a random weekly Famitsu. That'd be more something they do like social media, YouTube, at some sort of gaming event or something like that. As for what they could talk about when it comes to Integrate itself, I mean, it's obviously kind of hard to speculate. They could discuss, you know, development stuff, behind-the-scenes stuff. They could discuss some of the new, like, story elements or some of the, like, new gameplay elements. But that stuff we can't even, like, speculate on because it's brand new shit that wasn't in the first you know, remake game in terms of the gameplay, the fact that this, you know, DLC itself is all brand new, can't even begin to speculate what it could be. In terms of the story, I mean, like, we have a general idea of what the story of the DLC is, Yuffie, you know, coming to Midgar trying to get, like, this important material from Shinra, but as for, like, what's actually going to take place, you know, beat by beat through the two chapters, like, uh, fucking who, who knows? <laughs> no idea. I'm assuming there's going to be something very important within this DLC in terms of the story, since, it, you know, Integrate is supposed to be this bridge between Remake Part 1 and Remake Part 2. Like, there's got to be something big shown to us, revealed to us, or something in, in order to bridge those two games together. And with the ending of Remake, like, who knows exactly what the hell that could be. I am excited for Integrate in terms of what it's going to show us. I obviously have my gripes with it. We've talked about that quite a bit already over the past, you know, month and a half since it got revealed or whatever. But I'm excited, you know, I, obviously it's going to give us a new story for Remake, that's important, that's, that's something I'm looking forward to. Also seen a post over on Reddit about this weekly Famitsu thing coming up, and a lot of people are like, you know, they don't want to see any more when it comes to Integrate, which I do actually kind of understand. Like, even with the, the main game, a lot of people wanted to stray away from info. The thing is, like, even with all the info they gave us for Remake before it ever came out, there was still, you know, it's like a 30-hour game or whatever, 18 chapters, there's still so much we didn't know going into it, despite everything they showed to us. When it comes to Integrate, though, this is, you know, a relatively small DLC. It's only two chapters, and we don't know how many hours exactly that's going to entail. So, it, the, the more they show of, of Integrate before it comes out, like, there's going to be less and less that's going to be, like, surprising to us. Except for whatever the big reveals might be. And it's not even really speculation, but in regards to, like, Integrate being the bridge between Part 1 and Part 2, like, I, it has to deal with, I would assume, the ending. Like, that's obviously the big, like, what the fuck is going on after, you know, Remake Part 1 ended... So I'm hoping that Integrate gives us something. I don't know if it'd be like something with Zack or whatever the case, but us defeating you know the, the Whisper Harbinger and all that stuff, like whatever kind of effect that might have had, I'm assuming we'd get some sort of follow up with the end of like the UV DLC, like somewhere near the end of that, we should get more of that. That's my speculation. Remains to be seen. But of course, whatever info comes out of this weekly Famitsu tomorrow or so, we're gonna cover. It. We'll talk about it. You know, trying to get back into this shit, my dudes. We kind of heads not really been into it the past you know week or so. You guys know. But we're trying to get back into the grind, as the kids say. I'm going to kill myself. I'm going to That's the video. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. Give a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel if you guys are new. We'll see you more Final Fantasy VII Remake content. Turn on my notifications. Follow me on Twitter at DaphneDavidYT. I'm my Discord. The links to my social notebooks are in the description. And in the outro. I'll later, guys. Used to care what people thought. But now I care more. And nobody out here's got it figured out. So therefore, I've lost all hope of a happy ending. Depending on whether or not it's worth it. So insecure, no one's perfect. We spend it with no shame. We blow that. Like old train, we in here. Like low gain, or leave it. Like old bang.